Dr. Jay Hartley, Hartley Chiropractic Scoliosis Center in St. Augustine, Florida. And today we're going to be teaching you about the Scoli meter. The Scoli meter helps us to measure scoliosis in between x rays and also diagnose early scoliosis. So every seven degrees of tilt on the Scoli meter equates to 20 degrees on an x ray. So um, bend, go ahead and bend forward. Bend forward, and we're going to show them how it works. So as the Scoli meter goes along, you can see that that tilts. So if it tilts seven degrees, then that equates to 20 degrees on an x-ray. And we'll check L3, T12, and then also T7. All right, come on up. Now remember, it, you cannot totally rely on this. Meaning, you can have somebody that has a 3 degree angle on this, which would typically only mean a 9 degrees on an x-ray, but they may have a 20 degree curve. So we use this as an early indicator of how we need to track scoliosis. So um, many of the chi chiropractors and doctors that we work with throughout the country have these, and, and it allows us to communicate back and forth with does the patient have scoliosis or is the curve getting better or worse, okay? So we'll have more YouTube videos on this. This is Hartley Chiropractic and Scoliosis Center, Dr. Jay Hartley in St. Augustine, Florida. Have a great day.